On the issue of health care, explain what verification means. Well, on health care, if you don't have verification of who a person is, getting this whatever this national new national plan is going to be, that means anybody in the world can get it. Uh, you can have any kind of rules written down that you want to. It says that people with uh, you know, certain color eyes or, or certain size of feet can't get it, but the fact is you've got to verify it. And what we've had is, is a plan in the House uh, that has been passed in several ways that just says, oh, you've got to be here legally to get it, but no verification. And the House leadership has continually made sure that attempts for verification were voted down. Because of the outburst in, in the, in, during the President's address, the President uh, went back and looked at it and apparently agreed with us because he said, oh, well, we've got to have some verification. So the President has promised verification. Senator Baucus, the chair of the Finance Committee, has promised verification. Uh, at this point, uh, I believe that we're going to get some verification, but numbers you say will continue to monitor. Uh, we will, uh, you know, raise the roof if it turns out that we're not. The verification is not there. That's great. Uh, why did Numbers USA choose to get involved on healthcare verification? <clears throat> well, Numbers USA got involved with the healthcare bill only because of this verification issue. Uh, as, as most of our members know, we are a one-issue organization. That's why we were able to pull together Democrats and Republicans and independents and liberals and conservatives and pro-life and pro-choice. We have every kind of American as part of our organization for one reason, that's to reduce the overall amount of illegal and legal immigration. So we don't have a position on the health care bill, even though there's lots of reasons to be involved on all sides. We just know that we cannot have health care as an incentive for more illegal immigration. If you don't verify, then that means that people all over the world will be incentivized to come across illegally in order to get that, uh, that benefit. And so we, we must insist on verification to make sure that, that that reward is not there for people who choose to break our immigration laws. Okay, what would you say if they, to a member if they said they were being called an obstructionist? How would you advise them to handle that from the opposition? Our members called obstructionist? <laughs> well, I think you know on, on, on all of our issues, uh, the deal is, if you don't want to have this immigration issue slow down whatever it is you're trying to pass, then don't mess up on the immigration part in the first place. Uh, we, we just had another, uh, uh, another vote this week on something else entirely having to do with land designation. And the, the author of that bill refused to make clear that this was not going to hurt immigration enforcement. And, and the message we're trying to send to Congress is get the immigration stuff right in your bill because your bill is going to get really slowed down. It may be defeated. Uh, we will fight against any bill that has any chance of encouraging more illegal immigration or that has any chance of increasing the number of green cards and foreign workers imported into this country.